This is the BGA Cup preview show. It's beginning now. Okay. This is the welcome. B- yeah, welcome. Okay. This is a photo of people who are in the BGA Cup, except Vito. <laughs> Rest in, Vito's in a better place. Vito has uh Vito has been dropped out because of his um you know failure to uh, keep tabs with the BGA um when it's not the BGA Cup. And he's been replaced with Riley, who is more, you know, into the BGA Cup. And when we did not get enough members for um, for the BGA Cup to have, uh, what, fucking 10 people, then we had to drop Vito. Sorry, Vito. Um, we'll, we'll miss you. We still love you. Um, how do we go to the next page on this? <clears throat> okay, here we go. Well, this was mostly for Riley, but Riley can watch the recording. Um, the history of the BGA Cup. 2019. 2019 was pretty much the prehistory, I would call it. I wouldn't really call it the black team versus the blue team. It was kind of, we were, it was still a BGA Cup, but, you know, it was, it was, we're just testing things out. It was two versus two. It wasn't really, like, that legit. Um but it was a great time. It was a two-day tournament, the only two-day tournament in the BGA Cup history. Notable for that. Kyle and Kevin lost versus me and Nathan. Um, I, w- I gave myself the MVP, uh, of course. Um, I won the most points. 2020, moving on. Uh, this was the first true BGA Cup, I would say. Um, it had a the most members ever and that's still going to be the record after this year i had 12 people um but it is extremely controversial for last minute cancellations because there was a rainstorm (laughs) um it was it was one for the ages too if you looked at the map it was just like all of these clumps of green all day uh and it really scared some people away specifically nathan who is a you know, a very skittish member, but important member of PGA. Um, and uh, Ashen, who has never uh, participated in the BGA, uh, he also caused me to waste uh, $60 at Ravis, though, because I lost the rain check when he canceled for diarrhea. Um, but anyways. Diarrhea is a funny uh, word. So what happened was uh, we added uh, some last minute people and one of them happened to be the best player to ever play in the BGA and he went 4-0 and uh, the blue team absolutely murdered us for that reason. Um, so I, I will always uh, consider it not, you know, at the same level as uh, the 2021 BGA Cup, for example, but there's always going to be some kind of controversy. 2021 and didn't really have it in my opinion um uh kevin would you like to give any thoughts about what occurred in 2020 um i know i, I mean i'm giving my side of the story i said it's controversial um, would you agree with that or okay i guess we can't hear kevin let's see he's so, gone just let me in oh Shit, he's not even he's not even listening to this. It's Kyle shirtless. Mm-hmm. He says it keeps kicking him out. WTF? Mm-hmm. Well, then his internet sucks. <laughs> I'm talking to my friends. You got to go inside. Oh, it's, it's, Olivia, what are you even doing out here? Olivia is in the garage. <laughs> Olivia is in the garage. Go inside. Go go go. Because I'm Aww. shouldn't be watching children right now. Come on. So we can just walk huh? walking away. <laughs> oh, this is, this is great. Hey, Lou, what time you got work tomorrow? Hey. No, I don't got work tomorrow. Well, I'll, I'll, I'll watch out for the skunks. Mark. Kevin, I, I said, I, I, want you to, I wanted you to respond to the fact that I said the 2020 BJ Cup was controversial because of uh, Justin being involved and the cancellations. I just wanted to hear a response. I think it's controversial. You're the one who fucking brought him in. Okay. I, I mean, I can't. <laughs> I didn't even know this fucking guy. So I didn't know him either. I've controversial. Never him. That was the first time I met him. I, yeah. I, I have no control over that. But you would just agree that it was a controversial BGA Cup. 
Uh, maybe seems, if you didn't. Seems, uh, seems, so yeah, seems, seems pretty black. You and had white your chances. Me, you had your chances. That's the thing. <laughs> you had your chances. You made me put that one, and then we made you put everyone out of that, <laughs> and you fell apart. You fell apart. You crumbled yeah. on 10. Yeah. You crumbled on 10. That was the first hole of the match. I, I hit, also hit a four iron into the water on on like two holes later, like off the tee. I mean, it was just a bad, it was just a bad nine holes. Um, uh, anyways, that was at Bonnie Brook. Uh, that it rained for like the first four holes and we, you know, we got through it and everybody who canceled looked like the biggest fucking pussies for canceling because it only rained for four holes and we had a great day. Um, a good day. It was, it was I'm number it was two. I launched like, my driver farther than my drive. It slipped out of my hands and went further than the ball. So yeah. I don't know if they looked like complete. They did. Idiots, With, but 36 <laughs> holes and it rained for four of them. I would That's say, as far true. as days on the course, because it was predicted to rain so much and it scared everybody away. And True. then we pretty much had the course to ourselves. It was yeah, like, it was uh, the quote, yeah, the it, quote it, there's Reed, not going to be a it better was a perfect PGA day. To that. Yeah, that it was, was amazing. awesome. Good day. Oh, it's like, such a perfect day. I'm glad that I spent it with. All right, I muted Logan again. Uh, 2021 um, <laughs> was the first, what I would say, like, non-controversial legit bga cup um we played it at schaumburg um black team was extremely confident and we, we all know what happened um you know what there, happened there was some i'm putts. not sure i don't we remember. all know we all know yeah, what you recall it there was some putts made uh on the four ball match between <laughs> Kevin and Logan and myself, and uh, there, were, there were a lot of rule controversy. Which team made the putt? Some, I, I some don't putts made. <laughs> the Are we talking about maybe the most epic match in BGA Cup history? There would be a 30 for 30. Yeah. There would be a third. That was the turning point. There would be a 30 for 30 on that match. BGA I think, Cup, I think there's going to be there, there's going to be a better match this year, I think. It was pretty special. It was pretty special. It, uh, yeah, it's. I think I'll something's. I, what's that? I also want to shout out uh, the catfish girlfriend and oh, yeah. Kyle's Kyle's range Kyle's range meltdown was one for. Saying, I mean, there were just all time good moments. All time good moments in that thirty. Maybe there should be a thirty for thirty one day that we produce for ourselves. Steve can produce it. Yeah, I mean, it was a, uh, it was you know, it was a legit BGA Cup. It was a legit loss. You know, uh, it, it's it's. I'm trying to put it past me this year. Um, it was it was painful. Um, Kevin. Kevin reminds me every day about it with his profile picture, um, kissing the cup, and uh, you know. You feel let's like. Move let's move on. Um, no, speaking of, like... hold on, hold on, wait, um, one second. I just got to. Uh... Oh, he's got it in his garage. There, he's hogging it again. From his hogging team. it, I've had it for it. like two months out of the entire year. And to be fair, when Logan had it, when Logan had it and he brought it back, Logan the handles were missing. Destroyed the it. new I mean, improved. It's, it's, it doesn't have handles anymore. The new improved BGA Cup. <laughs> the new and improved. Just right. another like, trophy that the blue team has to win. Yeah. You know? We had we we had pretty good banter in the chat when that happened. And I was like, so I tore off the other handle so nobody would notice that the both <laughs> handles were gone. And then and I we all immediately like, noticed. <laughs> we, we all immediately noticed. You should have kept one on. I think that would have been perfect. Eric, I feel like you're trying to go places. And no, we're not it's fine. Yeah. This, this is important. Okay. This is important content. This hey, important. Uh, Eric, I have a question for you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Did you not just hear me? Do you feel like? Do you feel like eighty nine Jordan that like you got a taste of 
the BGA Cup or playing in the championship and kind of doing that thing? Or do you feel more like Charles Barkley where you might not ever get one? Okay. You're on the – you're on. Do you want to say hi? Say hi. Rosie. Hello. Who is that? Hi, Rosie. So it's, Kyle. it's Lou, it's Kyle, there's uh, Kevin and Steve. Hi. Uh, yeah. Hi. Uh, eat the rest of my sandwich. I don't really know what you mean by that because I don't follow basketball that much. But I mean, I have, I have redemption. One. Yeah, I mean, I feel good about this year. Um, I mean, I've won. I've, I've technically won one, and uh, and Kevin has technically won two as well as yourself. But I would say that there's really only one non-stained BGA Cup. Um, the first one is not really stained. It's just it was so small. That it's just, you know, it's kind of tin pot BGA Cup. Um, so anyways, anyways, this year we're doing uh, Blackstone and University Ridge. Uh, I want to just talk about the courses a little bit. Um, the people who have played here is me, Lou, and Steve. We played here last year. It's extremely cheap for what it is i think it was like what like 45 dollars or something good course. huh it's good course i like it yeah right. good course um if can you see my cursor here yeah mm -hmm. so i just want to point out on hole three there's a massive fucking tree here right in the mm -hmm. middle of the fairway really center dumb. line tree center line tree what does jt have to say about that it's terrible it's this is a really bad hole um also, I want to point out this hole, which is uh, 14, which Lou had a lot of uh, thoughts on. You have I'm, to hit I'm right have, in the water. You have to hit about a 200 yard shot to get to the edge here. And then it's an, it's a, I believe I hit a perfect shot and then I hit an eight iron. And there's a massive false front on the left. It's just a ridiculous fucking hole. Um, Sick. If you lay up too far back of the water, you've got a long iron into the green. And there's a good chance with our skill level, we chunk it or fuck it up and go into the water on your second shot. Yeah. So I'm going to drive it. And if I hit into the water on my tee shot, I've got 100 yards into the green for my third. Yeah. So the hole is ridiculous. But the fact that there is a massive false front. You got to clear. Left. You got to get You got to get to the front of the water from that, Lou. Otherwise, you're going behind yeah. it. If you lay up, if you lay up, like, th at this point, like, way far from the water, you are hitting a five iron at yeah. Into the green. Into a that really black tough. spot is the water. Yes. What this is, is it? Water. Even? This is it's water. Just it's just like, like a, a fucking man-made swamp. Man -made swamp? Okay. Yeah. It's called it's, fuck you pun. It's also it's like shit all around it. So it's like a hundred yards. It's essentially a hundred yard hazard. Yeah. I would say the course that it's most similar to would be Thunderhawk. Um which, you know, uh, Logan is going to love to hear, but it's not really surrounded by woods on all sides, on every hole, um, like the Underhawk. Uh, five is a uh, Biritz, I think. Yeah, five. five How do you say that word? Three. Big trees, Biritz? It's not a really good Biritz, I would say, but we'll see. There are a lot of cool holes. Here are some pictures yeah. of the course. Uh, this is a downhill par three that Lou, I remember, stuck an iron into that pin. Um, yeah. the par threes are really solid um, you can see that this is a fucking massive deep ass bunker I think both of the courses we're playing this year are pretty similar here is another this is like hole four with an uphill uh, I think this is a par five mm -hmm. shot I remember Steve stuck like a eight iron that like he I think he might have birdied or parred this hole Steve do you remember you hit a shot of the day I sure. do not remember It was only you would remember Gark your yeah. mind is mm -hmm. you're like a savant or sand valley hole this is the sand valley hole as lou calls it um i you know i completely blew up in this hole um but it's beautiful <laughs> it's beautiful in the back nine uh i don't have a picture of 17 but it's going to be it's going to be interesting coming down the stretch on their matches where we have uh this is 17 here a long par three over the water which is very similar to university ridge we're going to have a long par three over the water near the end of the matches um so lots of excitement how long is it uh they're both long iron holes um i would say seven iron or, or oh, okay. longer okay. Um, one thing i have to show about uh 
Blackstone is the insane. I've had maybe three or four fried eggs in my life and none of them have been this bad. Like Blackstone, I've had, I had two of the most insane fried eggs I've ever had in, in the fairway bunker. And like, there's nothing you can do about it. So this is one, I don't know if this is a good thing about the course, but don't, don't slam a drive into the side of a bunker or else this shit will happen. Um, Steve, do you have any high quality Sam? Pardon? Do you have any thoughts? It's a high quality Sam. Yeah, it's a good course. Um, yeah, that's all I have to say about it. It's a good course. Good course, Lou. I thought it was pretty playable, fun. So, like you said, some fun holes. I don't remember if the greens are too crazy, but they're not boring either. Um, you kind of got to hit all shots. There's, uh, it's everything you'd want to call in a course. Um, and do you do you remember the name of the worker you fell in love with? Oh, uh, Colleen or Caroline or something. Colleen, I think it was Colleen or something. <laughs> Didn't even keep them straight. There's so many of them. She's so pretty. She's Tiger Woods with. I want to. I want to sing her karaoke. I want to hold her hand walking down the fairway and sing her karaoke. Logan, why'd you put a shirt on? Take it off, bro. <laughs> it's cold. University Ridge is the second. What song? What song of karaoke would you sing her? Oh, we were gonna sing <laughs> Katy Perry. Katy Perry. Okay. Yeah, we got that about. song. That's uh -huh. you know. That's what they talked about. The fireworks one is that her? Or Teenage Dream? Teenage, Teenage Dream. Teenage Dream. Or the sure. one that got away. Oh wow! <laughs> wow, that would have been. Or oh, metal. Man. We, got, we got 10 minutes left. I'm just gonna fucking fly through. If you if University you Ridge. if it ends, you can just open another one. Okay. University Ridge, um, pretty similar. The front nine is like kind of like meadowy, like lots of prairie on the border of the fairway. Uh it's not a very good nine. There's a couple cool holes, I thought, but I didn't really like it. Um, I mean, it's okay. Why are we why are we doing it then? There are some cool holes. The back nine is fucking awesome. Um, I don't know. I mean, I was looking at some pictures of this course. Like, this is the front nine. This is a sick hole. I'm, I don't know. It is a good course. I think everybody really liked it, but it was also like pouring on us. And we were at the end of a pretty long trip. And uh, I was fucking dying. I like, I, I just overdid the drinking and smoking and uh, I could hardly get through the round. Um, and yeah, it was raining and we decided to walk a pretty much unwalkable course. Uh, definitely, we should have took carts. Yeah, um, it's definitely not walkable. Yeah. So and it, I was like beyond fucked up for this round. <laughs> yeah. It was, it was car path only also that day. I don't think I spoke for the first nine holes. Like, I don't think I said a word. Yeah, you didn't drink. You didn't drink on the front nine at all. I remember I ordered a White Claw and you did not want any of it. So um that says a lot yeah it does it really says a lot um it's robert trent jones running out of time the meeting will end in 10 minutes okay this is their signature hole because they think it's cool that they have all of these bunkers um, <laughs> useful i was i was in them yeah by and, the way uh, there, we can all meet in discord there's like speaker you, you can all join the talking channel discord yeah but i don't think you can record it yeah you're probably right this is the set par 317th where hopefully there will be some big moments with people hitting into the water at crucial moments 18 kind of sucks it's an uphill par four dog leg left i didn't really like it so hopefully most of the matches come down to this moment all right teams <clears throat> uh, most of you guys already know the teams except for steve i think um but Nathan and Riley don't know the teams. Um, black team, myself. Um, I am, you know, not playing so well this year. I've broken 90 only one day um, at Sand Valley. I broke it twice. Uh, not looking too good. That's all I'll say about myself. Uh, hopefully I can improve. Blue team, Kevin. Um, Kevin has not broken 90 this year. Uh, I don't know what what is your best score this year? Uh 91. 
91, so not bad. I mean, pretty similar level to me, I would say. Um, I, you know, my last score was like a 95. Kevin, uh, I don't know. How do you how are you feeling about your game? Are you gonna are you gonna break ninety before the BGA Cup? If you keep um, well, I'm gonna I'm gonna yeah, I should be playing a lot of golf before this, so um, I'm feeling pretty confident about where I will be at that point. Um, yeah, you know, I'm gonna play this weekend. I'm playing twice in two weeks. I'm gonna get some weekday uh, rounds in after work. Um, you know, I'm ready. I'm, you know, match play is where I excel. So I'm excited for, uh, you know, whoever I am matched up against, I'm ready for the challenge and I'm going to, doesn't matter. I lead my team to victory. That's what I do. So <laughs> get fucked, Kark. Get fucked. Kyle. Kyle is, uh, you know, He's still confident as as Kyle would always be. Um, he's, I would say, he's still searching for his game. Um, he's shot a ninety recently. Um, I want to see a couple lower scores to feel like he could be the one seed on the black team. But uh, Kyle, what do you think your game's going to be before uh, September fourth? Is that right? Something like that. Seventh or something. Yeah, I think you know I'm gonna remain quiet uh for a little while here Off i'm gonna let for kyle there i'm gonna let the uh yeah I'm, I'm gonna take a different course here i think i think what you see at the bga open is what you're gonna get even better of at the bga cup you so crap? Uh, huh you mean crap you're gonna no. play like both? <laughs> I didn't play like crap at uh, wherever the fuck we played last year. I played pretty good. I actually like had a first good. That was like two over after five or six of their oh, course. Yeah. That was fun. What course was that? Yeah, I was Cog Hill. Yeah, Cog. I keep wanting to see like, my dining. That was the only major where everyone played good, or like most. Yeah, every... like, some people. Played, yeah, some people played good. It was like the eighth hole or something. I blew up. There was such a stupid still fucking hurts. tree. It still hurts. But yeah, I mean, look, I got, I got, I wake up at 6 a.m. every day and go hit balls for an hour and a half. I've got access to all kinds of lessons and shit with like 30% discount. I don't have any excuses. So um, I'm, I'm tinkering with a lot of things and made a lot of positive changes already, but still kind of like constantly trying to tweak to make better improvements. Uh, so I, I've made a few adjustments this week. Uh, I made a lot of adjustments before I played with Logan and then all of them went to crap because I probably didn't practice enough <laughs> <with> changes, <laughs> but however, however, I will be doing nothing, but basically going to the driving range every day for a month and a half. So, uh, leading up to that. So I'll at least have a solid swing and be hitting the ball straight and uh and I'm, I'm pretty confident that with that for any of us with that much practice i'm going to be at least better than what i am uh now so my driver is the thing that actually works really well right now and which is annoying because now my irons are complete shit and my hands are all messed up so it's just getting the hands let's, get, let's switch off yeah so it's just uh, and then when the irons work the driver doesn't so it's just the fact that I'm going to be swinging obsessively. I feel like it should bring some muscle memory in, and I don't have to think about that as much anymore. This golf's a lot more fun when you're at least decent at it. So that'll be good. Uh, yeah. Searching for the game, but uh, I've set myself up for success, and that's why I am no doubt confident. Because if I don't fix my game uh, after working this hard at it, I'll quit golf, and then I will kill myself. <laughs> All right. Fair enough. Um, very very uh, intriguing comments by uh, Kyle. Um, so we can't if we lose the BJ Cup, I'll kill myself. So I think I think Kyle might be the biggest storyline of this BJ Cup because there's a of, lot of good storylines, a lot of good. I, storylines. But I think Kyle might be the biggest just because of the meltdown on the range last year. How can he come back? And I would not call that uh, a meltdown. I would call that determination. I don't. I don't know how you don't. Oh, yeah, it wasn't a meltdown. <laughs> yeah, it was um, him trying to find it. it was, the meltdown occurred earlier. Correct. On the course. 
I picked. I got three minutes. I remember left. it being. What do like, I do after this dies? Um, we're just gonna have to come back. I have create a new, yeah, cre cre create a new yeah, one. Just, send, yeah. Send the link. Okay. All right. Um, I don't want to talk about my practice plan because everything I say changes day to day. I was talking about going to Schaumburg every week. That's not gonna fucking happen anymore. Um, I'm just gonna, you know, try to get some rounds, and I have a couple rounds planned, but I don't really want to discuss what I'm gonna do because I don't think any of it's gonna be true. Um, we'll see. We'll see. I, I don't think I'm gonna be a good match for Logan at the moment, but I, hopefully I can uh, turn it on. Um, we'll we'll see who plays Logan. We don't know. We don't know. Uh, next slide. Logan. Oh, he's on the blue team. Um, go figure. Logan shot an 81 today, which was a uh, resounding message to the entire uh, black team that that's my know, A player. He means business in a, a no, a no handicap tournament. He can single handedly, you know, win it if if he can repeat that. But, you know, I mean, last year he didn't drink much alcohol and, uh, you know, we know what happened with me with the alcohol and uh, Logan, how do you feel about about your game going into the BJ Cup? I'm uh, I'm coming, I'm coming, and when I when I come, you feel it, you feel <laughs> me come. Specifically, you, Garg. <laughs> Specifically, you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right. Um, do you think that um, what you saw at uh, Sand Valley? you know, is going to scare you at all? Or do you think that was just- a I think, I think course, my, the worst thing that could happen to me is uh, course knowledge that I think you have. I think you held that on I me mean, on Sam Valley. I played and both I think, I think fast greens, super fast greens seems to be where it seems to be yours, Eric. Mm -hmm. Um when when the greens are fast, I think he put the best, and I think uh, I think short game goes uh, goes a long way in the BGA Cup. So mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, but my game my game's rounding out. I uh, I figured out some stuff this week. I uh, my 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 worst games are becoming better, and my best games are becoming lower. So mm -hmm. yeah. All really good stuff. I have less than a minute. I'm going to stop this and start again. Uh, we don't have much to go, but, you know, you might as well do it proper, right? Yeah. All right, next. Steve, <laughs> Steve is on the black team. Um, this is a big reveal for, for you, Steve. Um, you're back big. on the black oh. Big reveal. I don't know if you heard, but you're you're back with uh, me and Kyle. Um you know, you were one of the uh, pawns in the game because you don't have as much uh, um, history with the blue or black team. So we were considering switching you or Nathan around, but we decided to bring you back. Um, and, uh, you know, we hope that you help us lift the cup. Uh, how do you feel? Um, tell us about Tell us about your uh, your opinion. I know you haven't you haven't broken ninety this year. I don't think you, you don't do it very often, but you're always low nineties, pretty consistent. You're, 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 you're kind of suicidal this year in terms of golf, but, um, mm -hmm. but you know that's fairly uh, part part for the course for you. Um, mm -hmm. What do you think? Oh, uh, what an honor it is to to be in the black team. <laughs> <laughs> you know I, I i feel how i typically feel about my golf game where you know i'm uh i'm one hole away from permanent retirement so you know that's always good but uh uh you know i think match plays it'll sue me well yeah i have like weird strengths that are other people's weaknesses like i can hole out of a bunker randomly and um pretty good with like chipping so i think you know and, and match play that that makes me a serviceable target and uh or a serviceable uh representative of of the black team which once again i am honored to be on once again and uh yeah yeah i would just if like, i could find yeah, a way to drop the ball past just, 180 yards I, I think i'll i think i'll be a, a more valuable asset but uh 
I've always admired the way you blade. Sorry, I'm sorry. I, I've always admired the way you blade uh, chip shots into the hole um, from uh, mm -hmm. you know, with the full 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 pace. Oh, here we go. Logan's here. But yeah, I just always admired about that about that um, with match play. You know, it's, it's a beautiful technique that you use. Um, you know, Steve. So you know, Steve's excited because he's already wearing his uniform. Yeah. Yeah, Steve. Steve All he wears is black, so I'm not sure I've ever seen him in any other yeah, color. Now, now I know why Logan's late. The Macho Man Logan Rocks <laughs> the PGA Cup. Woo! Where is Logan? Um, oh. Anyways, I'm. He was made for the. Why is he late? What is he doing? What do you mean? What am I doing? Oh. Okay. There he is. What do you mean? What am I doing? I didn't see. I didn't see him at first. He and had to. He had to sprint to his closet and find this fucking outfit. <laughs> Dying. <laughs> Well, if you get a blue one of those and wear it, you know. <laughs> He's just going to say. Oh, you should be, this should be the red yeah. team immediately. Oh, yeah. All right. Next. Next is Nathan. <laughs> I think we all knew that Logan and Nathan were going to be on the team. Um, you know, the best and the worst golfers in the BGA Cup. Um, Nathan... We're, you know, I've been talking about every player and their ability to break 90. Well, Nathan is, you know, more of a breaking 100 type of player. So it seemed only, you know, to make sense that Logan would be with Nathan. Um, I love that Gark is acting like he, like, was giving him a concession here when I picked the man to be on the squad. I picked this man. I picked this team. Pick Nathan? I picked the blue team to be who we are. So that we can destroy the black team once again. Oh yeah! <laughs> what would you like to see out of Nathan before the BGA Cup, Kevin? Uh, let me, you know, he's he's well. We are ball. gonna be, we're gonna be, hopefully, if he has his clubs. Apparently, his clubs are in his car that is in a auto shop right now. But we are supposed to play a match on Saturday. Um, I just want to see Nathan hit the ball far because he can do that. That's all he did. Well, if, I mean, I guarantee you're going to see and, that. You're going to see and that. If he can, and if he can connect in a few holes, that's all we're looking for out of Nathan. Nathan can string together three holes in a row of good golf. That gives him a, an opportunity, uh, right. especially in the, when he has a teammate. You know, if he can just hit some good shots, that's all we need out of him. But we're not even worried, so it doesn't even matter. I Nathan say, could go Owen. Nathan lost all four matches last year, correct? Um, I think he tied one. He tied one. All um, right, so o three and one, and we yeah. still easily won the cups. So, um, yeah. we just need him to uh, participate. Nathan is there for the vibes. Nathan is there for the, the weed. camaraderie. He's there for the. He's a hype man for us. Yes. We, yeah. we love Nathan. Nathan's okay. perfect. All right. Yeah. Uh, I just want to point out that three three holes is not going to do so much on an 18-hole match, as they're, they're all 18-hole matches this year. If he puts three holes together when he's when he's when when his other teammate is struggling on those three holes, that's all we need. Well, what about all shot? Need. What about – do you know all shot is a part of this? He'll be fantastic for that because he's either going to hit it fucking perfect or it's going to be fucking terrible. So <laughs> it'll, it'll be perfect for that. All right. We're we're not even worried. We're right. not even worried. Okay. I'm just, you know, I just want to get that out there. You know, it's, you know, it's everybody. Everybody is pretty even this year, except for Logan and Nathan. That's what we determined. Um, we want Logan to get worse and we want Nathan to get better. That's what we want. Um <laughs> Who's rooting for me to get worse? Me, me. Oh, Gark only. Don't worry. It's not like I'm rooting for you to get worse. It hurts. <laughs> I'm rooting for you to get better. Riley is on the black team. This is uh, 
Uh, this is looking kind of controversial after today. Um, Riley shot an 88 at a Jack Nicholas course. Yeah, it's um, one day. Yeah, after – look. I mean, His own teammate. Just, it's only it's one only day. One day. Yeah, sucks. I mean, think of, the, the butterflies of stepping up to the tee on your first PGA Cup are going to harm a score maybe four look, or five. That is – we are yeah, just laying down the his... groundwork for, in case we massacre the blue team, we're just laying down the groundwork that we know that, you know, this is a little, this is a little unbalanced here. Um, you know I... what? The blue team does not give a fuck about balance because we show up and we fucking play golf and we Look, drink we... fucking beer and we fucking do drugs and we fucking <laughs> win. That's, That's what the fucking blue team does. That is does. true about half of, yeah. half of the blue team does that. Half of the blue team does that. If you if you take all of the blue team and mix them together, we all do that. A little bit of all, a little bit of one of those things. That's all that matters. Cream rises to the top. <laughs> Look, we can we can talk about if the if the teams are fair or not, but no matter how you put the teams, it's completely based on how I play. I'm this whole scenario. At Lou, right as now, I, Lou is as just I said, so much to this preview show just... is, Lou, is Lou asleep <laughs> Lou. yeah he, fall, he falls asleep pretty easily <laughs> let sleeping beauty sleep maybe we'll be in his dreams oh. probably will be oh, Lou. this is amazing this is amazing <laughs> alright I'm going to go back to Riley for a second Riley, uh, I've seen him play golf once. Um, it wasn't his finest day um, at Glenview Park. He had the duck hooks on the back nine. Uh, he's a very angry lad, which I can relate to. Um, and, uh, you know, he gets down on himself, which Steve and I uh, are experts at. Um, so I think he's going to fit in well with the culture of the black team. Uh, <laughs> Kyle is... Uh, Kyle is the shining light of positivity that we need to carry us through the, the dark times. Um, and uh, yeah, I mean, I think that's, I think we just, we just feel like the worst is going to happen and then hope for the best. And uh, that's just kind of the black team's motto. Um, so, yeah, I think, uh, I, I think he's got the potential to be good. Obviously he, he looked like he shot a great round at Highland woods, despite a 10 on the scorecard. I saw a lot of pars, which is great for match play. Um, so I think he, he, he could potentially be our top seed, but you know. I uh, also want to say Riley is a all time club thrower. I think he fits in your culture like that. The guy can, uh, the guy can throw a club. Looks you know, he's bad, but he doesn't throw his clubs. All right. He, uh, yeah, fair enough. But uh, Ry Riley can. I mean, I saw him with a probably about a sixty-yard throw. Yeah. Uh, with his, uh, <laughs> yeah. With this like uh, wedge yeah. on maybe hole six, hole five. That long par five. Yeah. Um, yeah, I think I think the storyline with Riley is first BGA Cup. How is he going to cope with the pressure? How is he going to cope with the, the different games that we're playing that he is not used to playing? Uh, I think he's got a lot of pressure on his shoulders um, mm -hmm. to, to be the, the one new guy out of all eight players um, that he's going to want to really perform well. And, uh, you know, that can, that can uh, cause some issues early on. And if, that, if it gets them early, it could get them for, you know, the whole 18. Luckily, this year it is a two-day event so he could uh recover uh overnight but that's tough you know it'd be in the only new guy so but um, i mean i will say that essentially we've replaced riley with Vito, who was the worst player you know you know worst player in the tournament with a person who is kind of slots in to possibly the fourth best player in terms of handicap and uh you know the pressure is definitely on him to deliver because uh, if if he's going to replace Vito, he's got to he's got to deliver points, and black team has no excuse not to win. Um, so yeah, I think you're right about that. Uh, Sleeping Beauty is uh, rounding out the uh, rest of the blue team. Um, <laughs> not Sleeping Beauty. 
Oh, Lou. Are you oh, he's alive. I've been here well, the whole time. Lou, 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 Lou. Lou. The heart. The heart of the blue team. Lou is rounding out the the heart of the blue team. I will say that Lou is, you know, some people have said Kyle is the biggest storyline of the BGA Cup. I think Lou is the biggest storyline of the BGA Tour this year because of um, the amount of strokes he shaved off his handicap. He is, uh, he's definitely a player to be reckoned with. He's broken 90 this year, correct? Yeah, one said uh, Winneka. Damn. So, I mean, he's he's playing better than me right now, who I'm the former or, or current number one seed of the black team. He's I would say he's playing better than me consistently right now. Um, I think that's a huge storyline. I think Lou is the reason why we decided to allow Riley on the black team because of the amount of progress he's made this year. Um, and uh, how do you feel about your your – new position in the BGA with your low handicap and uh how do you think you're going to do this year I think good um I'm playing pretty well feel like I haven't put together a full round it's a mix and this is part of being a high handicap or you know whatever you call 20 is 20 a high handicap you know which is basically you know the run of the mid handicap whatever it is Part of being a 19 or to 20 handicap is you have your good shots and you have your bad shots. Um, one day I can drive it and I, I can't hit my irons. The next day I can't get off the tee, but I'm chipping and putting really well. I haven't put together one really great full round outside of, I guess, um, Winnetka, which I think is probably the best I've ever played. It was a decently tough course uh, with a lot of narrow corridors. Um, what I just need to improve on is uh, my, my mental game and not just in terms of, oh, you know, keeping emotions in check, all this stuff, but, you know, seeing the course, knowing uh, where to aim, knowing where to miss um, and, and playing a hole in a very smart way. But, hey, I'm rolling right now. Uh, I've had the driver mostly under control. Short game is still a little bit. Uh, I think I put it pretty well, um, but I'm just – Ready to have fun. BGA Cup is the best. The BGA Tour is the best. Uh, great golf courses, great people. I cannot freaking wait. Oh, yeah. Um, so one thing that Logan uh, probably hasn't heard about, I think Logan heard about the teams because we had to kind of approve them with him since it's, you know, a little, a little controversial. Perhaps. Oh, my God. Uh is there's a rule change this year. Um, so these are the formats. Day one, we're doing Chapman, and then we're doing best ball, like which is what we call four ball. Day two, we're doing alt shot and then singles. But this this is just placeholders. Oh. This is just placeholders. The, the oh, match yeah. Because what we're decided to do this year is that the captains are able to basically pick their teams there's not going to be seeds this year. If, if, uh, since everyone is pretty even besides, you know, Logan is a little bit better than everyone. And Nathan is a little bit worse than everyone. Um, since everyone's pretty even this year, I, there's not really a need for seeds. And like in the Ryder cup, they just pick their, um, teams, you know, who they want to put out for the format and they just pair people together and put them out there. I don't know exactly how it's going to work. If like me and Kevin have to agree on which, teams that we pick play which teams but at least the singles were definitely gonna like not make it so it's unbalanced so so like uh logan is not playing our worst player and i'm not playing their um worst player assuming i'm i'm a decent player by then but we don't know exactly how it's gonna work out but the thing is is we're gonna be able to pick the teams and the pairings this year it's not gonna be like so if you want to put um logan with the strongest player the second strongest player on the blue team for all of the uh, group matches that is an option or the worst player it's up to you so that's kind of the big change to the format this year uh I'm thoughts. Play logan. thoughts anybody i'm playing logan kevin what do you uh, think you're gonna you're gonna come with something better than you you mm-hmm. did this past weekend yeah i ain't gonna show you i'm not showing you shit 
Kevin, man, what are you thinking? I know that you pair well with uh, Nate. You've had some epic, ma epic matches with Logan. Uh, yeah. We're good you know, what do you think? As a, as a winning captain uh, who knows his teammates, um, you know, I'm going to have discussions with each player, uh, see how they feel about things. I want to make sure they're comfortable. Uh, I want to, you know, make sure my teammates, my, you know, are, are, are more comfortable than me. Uh, yeah. I, I'm willing to be uncomfortable as the captain of the blue team, unlike the fucking shitty ass captain of the black team who can't fucking lift a trophy to save his life. Uh, you know, we, uh, <laughs> we, we work together on the blue team over here. So, um, I'm going to have some discussions. We're going to figure it out as are a team, gonna... uh, I have a question for you. Are you going to get into uh, analytics like the, the Euro team does and, uh, you know, really get dig into the data? I know that uh, Logan has Arcos now, so maybe you can. Well, we are. Uh, Arcos? I, don't, I don't have the Arcos. That, that's oh, my buddy yeah. Joe. Oh, I'm a, I am a, I'm a feel guy, so I don't think I'll be looking <laughs> too much into the analytics uh, of the BGA <laughs> tour. I'm not sure how many analytics there are to get into. Um, but you know, it will be a, uh, it'll be a long thought out process. We have, you know, over a month before, before the matches, uh, kick off. So we got a lot of time to work out some things. Uh, there might be some blue team, uh, team building exercises that we might do down, uh, down the road here, uh, to get ready for it. And, you know, we're, we're we'll be prepared. Uh, what the hell does that mean? I watch you guys get drunk. <laughs> no, that means we might go play fucking golf together or something. Oh, Jesus okay. Christ, Lou. Fuck. We might go That's to the top golf. Too, I was thinking some that. Balls. I was thinking that. Uh, maybe we might go scout one of these fucking courses that uh, we're going to play. Um, uh -huh. Play it together as a foursome and see what we do. I um, guarantee nobody's going to drive out to Blackstone. Besides maybe Lou. You don't, you don't far fucking away is know. It? The blue team is way more dedicated than the fucking black team. You guys so, didn't. Even, uh, you guys didn't even drive out to Schaumburg last year, and the black team. I did, like motherfucker. Well, you did. Yes, I, that's right. We I had spent a the scout. I spent the entire. I spent five days straight at Schaumburg Golf Club, and it ruined my life. <laughs> say, did you a lot of? Did you a lot of good? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it ruined my life. <laughs> so uh, yeah, you know, we'll we'll see what happens. Uh, I'm excited. Uh, we have the four members from the blue team last year defending the title. Uh, it's a it's a true title defense, uh, which we have not had in a BGA Cup yet. So super, super excited for that. I think it's going to be fantastic. Uh, I love the two-day uh, uh, format where we're playing 18 whole matches. It's going to be fucking lights out. I can't wait for it. I hope, uh, you know, I hope the black team is prepared to get their fucking asses whooped again because, you know, it's, it's hard to continue to lose and lose and lose. So, you know, I hope you guys are ready. Uh, the second night that we stay in the hotels, I hope you guys are ready to watch us drink a lot of beer out of the BGA cup. Uh, Cause you know, and we'll pour some coffee in there for Lou or something like that. <laughs> But, um, you know, we're going to fucking destroy you guys. So looking forward to it. Yeah, that was a that was a great speech. We'll see if any of that comes true with, uh, you know. Definitely intimidated. <laughs> it should be, Steve. The one person that I can't talk shit to is Steve. I just, that doesn't feel right. So well, we're going to put Steve. Uh, Steve, I hope you play really well. The rest of you, fuck off. <laughs> Steve is terrifying. He's sandbagging is. son of a bitch. Steve could literally win every match that he's in. Asylum, yeah, the Asylum Assassin. I would not be surprised. I got a, I got a couple more slides here. Uh, Hotel Lou, tell us what you booked. What did you book? Uh, we got two rooms at the Holiday Inn. They're both That's suites. True. So they okay. got two queen beds and a uh, pull-out couch. Okay, Sick. not bad. And there's eight yeah. of us? Yeah, yeah, that's plenty. Everybody gets. I feel like that's like maybe one bed. Okay, it'll be fine. I think it's be a hundred bucks a man. Really? So yeah, what happened with country nights. country suites? They said they didn't have those. Ones? They were all booked. Fuck, dude! I should have just booked it. Except why the fuck? What is happening there that they're booked? 
they had, football? they had like yeah. seven they had like seven rooms when i called oh fuck there might be college football was there a home there game that weekend, weekend? doesn't matter we, we never already, even thought about that we already got the tea time so it's not a big deal yeah no i just all think coming to the that DJ would be Cup. god i hope there fucking is a college football game there that would be awesome yeah but aren't we doing like thursday friday or something yes yeah but we're staying friday night oh okay. so we would be there saturday I'm, like I'm friday hoping. night it's I gonna be fucking saturday. nuts if there is a game the hell do we want to watch that shitty football team for i don't want to watch the, bu- the football i want the atmosphere the of the football I got to play on Saturday anyways, but whatever. Um, what was it gonna I got to play on Saturday because I'm fucking – Yoko fucking is hanging out with me. All right, you better watch it. You better lock it up. <laughs> oh, Yoko. <shit. laughs> you better watch what you say. All right, that's, that's off limits. All right, my apologies. <laughs> La Linea. La Linea. Um, all right, lost my train of thought. Um. Okay. One thing I was going to say is I have not um, confirmed with Blackstone yet, so be prepared for a potential venue change. Oh, wow. Why? Interesting that uh, he's just going to spring that on us last minute. Seems <laughs> not sketchy. the last minute. You sound, like, you sound like my ex-wife who said, um, <laughs> I, you, it sounds like I told her today that I couldn't do a birthday party with her three months in advance, and she said it was the last minute. That's what you sound like right now. We have a Certainly. more than a month. If more than one birthday, hmm? Jasmine's birthday? birthday, Jasmine's birthday party. I, I changed uh, it. October, yeah. It was a lot. She said, it, she said I changed it at the last minute. Uh, but you know, it's, it's a pretty big birthday apparently party. It's July. Do you guys uh, know me and Jasmine share a uh, birthday? I, 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 oh, wow. I always forget. I always forget. All I right, know. so I got to call Blackstone, but I think it'll be okay. I mean, I didn't see any events on their website. Last but not least, the future of the BGA Cup. This won't change. <laughs> not at all. Look, Zero chance. This you, changes well, at all. okay. The, it's not going to change that. it. We laugh about that, Logan, but we have stayed <laughs> with the current, the current major schedule this year, actually. Okay. We sure. sure. We've done it. <laughs> sure. We've done it. It's, it's, uh, this is the intention. Well, this is the intention. The only way that this stays is if Gar calls the golf course and lets them know that we have tea times. Yeah. So yeah. just do that. In 2023? Yeah. Well, I mean, I'm not just <laughs> talking about the venues here. I'm talking about the future of the BGA Cup in terms of size. I think in 2023... We got to try to go back to 12 people. So this is what happened with the people I tried to recruit from like previous BGA Cups. Dan like immediately said no, like no, like it was just a straight up no, because that he, he always goes up to Lake Arrowhead by Sand Valley. So just maybe we need to move it to August for, for Dan and then we can get Jeremy back and but do we really want a 12 person cup? I don't know. This is a discussion for maybe not a Zoom call. We should go to bed or let the, Lou. The go. only way we, we can have 12 is if there are 12 people that are playing with us regularly. Yeah. I mean, I don't know. I don't know about that. I want I want eight. I think eight. Eight's if good. you want to keep if you keep storylines and characters involved, the more you have us being parts of the storyline then what if you hear me out and nobody has to answer what if we do uh what if we do a live event <laughs> next year bring some teams <laughs> bring some teams so like I, you i'm gonna know, mute logan of, i'm gonna mute it could be like two of us and then we could like be in charge of our own teams get it for no. a couple days no mm-hmm. no only if your whole team wears exactly what you're wearing right now. Maybe we will. Maybe we will. All right. All I have to say is I don't <laughs> have anything else to say. Uh, this next year we're gonna do um, we're gonna split between uh, the black teams' hometowns. Uh, I mean the captains' hometowns. So I'll be living in Wheaton by then. Um, Whoa! I'm just kidding. What? 
I'm just joking. But uh, he's not. <laughs> oh. Yeah, he's not. He's been telling me this for months. So gonna it's gonna happen. No, I don't know if it'll happen. Honestly, it's uh, yeah, I don't know. But anyways, Cantini is a 27 hole golf course, which is very expensive. Um, but I think uh. I was going to say, what I wanted to say was if it's just us eight, then perhaps we should wait until Bandon. But Bandon is a mess because it's in November. People are going to start getting rusty. There is I don't a- want Bandon to be the BGA Cup. Okay. So this is what we're going to do. I don't even keep at Bandon. I want Bandon to be a fucking BGA championship. good time. BGA Championship. Well, we fuck well, off. But- I withdraw. But we're playing 36 holes for four days, so the whole thing is going to be the BGA Championship. Isn't it 36 oh, holes no, there's four like days? A, there's two rounds. There's two rounds that are going to be affected by daylight, so we're not going to include those in the competition. All right, we'll talk about it. Anyways, that's it. We should just end. Um, <laughs> we should just end. <laughs> the only thing I want to say is 2025 in Sand Valley, they will have another course at least one more i think they might do another short course that would be a good reason to go back to sand valley and uh you know i'm sure we'll go back there before but to to stay to stay there in a resort you know a couple nights why where's 2026 on this schedule i i I didn't put it in there because i felt like we wouldn't want to go to uh wisconsin like two years in a row so it's a mystery you know maybe michigan Maybe and one of us could die, and then we'd have to pay to go down the six. Right. But we need I to think, have, I, I think, think Michigan have, would be great. Yeah, but we, have, we got a Michigan course here, but maybe we'll go deeper into Michigan. It, I'm, I'm talking like um, northern Michigan. Give me some northern Michigan's the best. Give me some Michigan spots that are interests, and then like I have a uh, like one of my people I work with. Um, he has a lot of connections to country clubs up there. Um, so he might be able to get us a decent deal. I thought you left um, that job and you can't get us on country clubs anymore. No, I have not left that job. That, oh, and were you telling me that? Yeah. Yeah. Um, but yeah, let me know or, uh, or I can get kind of a list from him and then, like he he says it's pretty good and he only plays country clubs. So, you know. Yeah, let I, us I think tell him to let us have the BGA Cup there and just make fools out of Yeah, it. I'll let him know that, that we're gonna have the BGA Cup there and then and then I'm gonna <laughs> see what there. a spatial read after that. Oh, and no. then I'll, I'll try to <laughs> I'll see what he's twenty twenty six, yeah. <laughs> uh, in four years from now, he yeah. hooks me up with a tea time. <laughs> but maybe i mean it's an option like maybe next year like if we want to go up there and, and do something and then if we really like it you know i i might have it in there so is it oak hill or oakland hills that's up there i think it burned down he doesn't have a connection to any of the down ross prestigious uh andy andy johnson courses there's no way i, I think he he does but probably not for the entire group Tell him we want to go play. Uh, what is that fucking course called? Uh, I don't remember. It's way north by Traverse City. Well, I mean, if I put Plus. the BGA Cup, if I bring the BGA Cup up, then I'm sure it'll yeah. improve chances drastically of getting in wherever you exactly. want to get into. Exactly. What if you? Yeah. What if you bring the cup to work? <laughs> well, you gotta win it first. Yeah. 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 Hey. Right. 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 Hands. Fantastic point, Lou. Fantastic point. Pretty I think much. I went through. Last year, so I'm not going to take any blame for any of my team's shortcomings. Yeah, I like oh. that. I like that, Steve. <laughs> yeah, it was all it was all Gark and Kyle's fault. Mm-hmm. Yeah, whatever. I mean, think that's this year it'll be my fault though. Sure. It's going to we'll be see. another forty minutes. Yeah, we're it's going to be a fucking bloodbath. That's what it's going to be. We'll Murder. see. We'll see. It's a it's a tough course. A lot of balls will be lost on both courses. So, um, Lasonia yeah. is good too. Yeah, Lasonia will be great. We have to we have to be Jake up there. Um, the best anything. link. For- uh, I'm signing off. Um, good good talking to everybody, and uh, see you at the BJ Open in a couple of weeks.
Lou just left immediately. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, y'all. All right, see so, yeah. you. Know.